Madam? Mr. Fry? Ready to take the air? Devil's Acre should just be coming alive. I am afraid I must cancel our engagement. The lawn is crawling with scandal-hunting journalists, and I simply cannot be seen in the company of someone so... I'll see them off. You follow along when it's clear. Yes, yes. Uh, be gentle, won't you? The press are notoriously touchy about any violence to their person. Ha, 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 ha. I'll barely ruffle a hair on their heads. Shh, Desmond. That's yours, if you can get those chaps over there to follow me. Right you are, sir. Blimey! Look! It's Squire Bancroft! Best lead them astray before they tear me to shreds. Mr. Bancroft! Mr. Bancroft! What's coming up next for the Prince of Wales? Will you be performing Mr. Robertson's new work? Who will you be playing? Any comment on the notices for the play? to deal with the liberals. Doing fine, girl. That's the way. Walk on, girl. a girl oh, what a rough place give me your arm mr. fry let us see what the devil's acre has to offer
Is your dog quite all right? Oh, Desmond's fine. He's just not over for the street. Or cats. What is he up to? I can't imagine he's up to any good. Do you know this gentleman is a... Oh, what was it? Yes, isn't he? a costermonger, of all things. Remarkable how the working classes occupy themselves, isn't it? Very industrious, I'm sure. Shall we go?
Mr. Fry. Look at those two. Uh, yes, they, uh, they seem to be, um... I've been married twice, Mr. Fry. I'm fully aware of what they're doing. Yeah. 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 Oh, bless them. not to ask. Why? Is it something dreadful? <gasps> is it rat? I don't mean to be indelicate, given the present company, but another name for it is Bow Wow Mutton. Here we are. The old... So, this is a pint, is it? <laughs> Remarkable. Nice doggy. Mm. Change your tune when me and my friends find you. Now then, Desmond, to get you back to your mistress, whom I have just left entirely unattended in one of London's most dangerous pubs. Well, if you never told your father how you felt about him, how was he supposed to know? I never thought of it that way. I suppose deep down we all just want to be loved. Just so. Mm. Here, have a sweetie. Oh, Desmond and Mr. Fry, I'd like you to meet... Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. John the Tosser. Charmed. I think we'd better get you home. Right you are, Mr. Fry. Come along, Desmond. <laughs> Well, well, well. If it isn't the dog walker. <laughs> now, let's not do something we'll regret. Walk on, girl. That's the way. Well, I must thank you for the energetic and enlightening evening, Mr. Fry. No, thank you. Perhaps now you might tell me about the man in the Hussar's uniform. Quite right. Lord Cardigan is the gentleman you seek. Tiresome. Always blabbering on about his military adventures. 
Do you know where I might find him for a private conversation? I do indeed. He's in town now, as it happens, campaigning against the corrupt practices bill. Perhaps you could catch him in the Palace of Westminster. Do be careful. Steady on. The government could ill afford another scan. I assure you, I'll be very discreet. Let's go. Your stop, madam. My stop? <laughs> How delightful. Thank you. Thank you for a splendid evening, Mr. Fry. I shall be sure to speak highly of you to Dizzy. <laughs> oh, yes. 